For this video, I'm going to show you how to create a quick and simple gunshot wound using Sculpt Gel. This can be a great addition to your costume or a costume in and of itself. When you're using Sculpt Gel, it's very important to mix equal parts of A and B. Mine have cross-contaminated a little bit by the time I started working with it, so mine is quite thick, but it should be pretty smooth. And make sure that you also use different spatulas for the different jars. And I'm using a third spatula to carve out my design. So you can see I'm just placing the product and then I am slowly but surely digging myself a hole in the middle. Don't worry too much if you're getting some texture around the wound because the skin would have broken if you got a gunshot wound and at the same time a lot of the color is gonna disguise it. I'm mixing a little bit of yellow into my grease paint so that I get a little bit of a warmer look to it. But make sure to not make it look orange. I made the brush I'm spreading the product out with and I just took a regular blending brush with natural bristles and just cut it down to get that stiff kind of splotchy look. And now I'm just using some light skin tone to add some depth into my wound. I'm still using grease paint. I'm now adding some blood red splatter around the wound and then I'm using some blue grease paint but you can also use black to create that gunshot powder that would have come with a gunshot wound and just make sure to splat this very randomly around it and remember that this would have been from the bullet and now I'm just adding a red base into the inside of my wound and then I'm adding some blood paste to properly create some depth into the wound And I'm just using a spatula to drag that blood properly out. This is quite thick, so it's gonna be easy to work with once you place it down. And then I'm just adding some foundation to blend in my wound before applying fake blood. All products used as well as my social media is linked in the description below. I'm finishing up my makeup with a pore sponge and fake dark blood. Thank you so much for watching my video, this is the finished gunshot wound look. Make sure to give this video a like if you liked it and make sure to tag me in photos if you decide to recreate this look, I would love to see it. And make sure to subscribe to my channel if you want to stay tuned for the rest of October. I'm posting 15 videos in 30 days, so there's gonna be more Halloween inspiration coming. And I'm leaving some links to my old videos if you want to watch more today. And have a lovely October.